Water is soft and gentle, but also fierce and powerful when it gets angry. It shows that most clearly in today's video of extreme tsunamis, flash floods, and waves caught on camera. Watch till the end and let us know your thoughts in the comment section. Let's get it on. A very serious flood in Gilgit Jutiel Nala. Fear seems to have gripped residents of Gilgit city surrounded by natural disasters. All houses at Jutial, Yassin, Yusainabad, and Darmir colony were vacated. The flood had damaged the Nalco head office boundary wall and main gilded road near MP checkpost. Water channels of Yassin colony, Zulfi Karabad, Jutial, and Komer have also been damaged. Death of the flooded stream near Shul Iyal's boundary wall has increased by around 30 feet. Landsliding at the mountains of Neko damaged several houses. The historic flood that engulfed Cali in early 2023. Viral video shows a levee break along the Salinas River, which has overflowed its banks. There are several levee breaks along the river, and water can be seen rushing through flooding farmland this large area. Amazing footage showing the tsunami breaking into Mihako City, Japan. It's so sad. They had barely any time to process the earthquake when the tsunami comes rolling in. They probably thought their houses would be good enough to rid it out. May God bless all. The truly horrific images captured on video will ensure that future emergency broadcasts will not be ignored. And the only certainty is that there will be more tsunamis. Seeing the two residents of the roof looking down at the raging maelstrom, seconds before their own building was swept from its foundations and disintegrated amid the left of the breeze field gave insight into the final horrific moments of so many people that day. Padang is the largest city on the western coast of Sumatra. Padang Padang is an extremely dangerous surf destination and is not recommended for surfing beginners. The waves break in winter swells. It is usually jam-packed and there is no water on the reef. Pedra Branca is a small island located on the southern coast of Tasmania and is the home to a huge wave surf break. They are known for their extreme weather conditions, large waves and a variety of marine wildlife. In 2003, Hamish Saunders was literally swept off of Pedra Branca. A deadly wave hit the island and the heavy spray caused him to drown. Ghost Tree got its name because months can go by and you would never see a wave. Then out of nowhere, a powerful wave will appear. Professional big wave surfers risk their lives waiting patiently at Ghost Tree just to catch the right wave. Once they do, the adventure begins and they launch the ride of their life. 
Surfer Peter Davey died in a massive wave at Ghost Tree in 2007. T. Hoopo is the most dangerous break in the world. The waves there have a unique combination of size, power and speed, made more dangerous because they break over the sharp coral reef lying only meters below the surface. In one of the first competitions held in Tihupo, the contest boat carrying the judges and marshal was struck by a wave and capsized. There were several deadly tornado events in the south this year. In March, nearly 30 tornadoes ripped across seven states, causing more than $1 billion in damage and killing three people, according to the National Weather Service. They look okay. okay. Batches of deadly tornadoes continued until late in the year. It's on the ground. Let's subscribe to our channel to see more videos about this side of nature. Not forget, comment to let us know stories about some natural disasters caught on camera. See ya!